We're here with Bellagio Tournament Director Jack McClelland for another segment of Card Player TV's Ask Jack. Thanks for being here, Jack. Pleasure. So we have a question one of our viewers emailed in to us. He was in a tournament, the blinds were 200-400, and a player called out of turn. Then the player who was to act in front of him made a raise. Was the, play the player who put the 400 in, could he take that back because nobody acted behind him? Or does his $400 have to stay in the pot and he then has the option to raise, fold or call? Uh, in, in tournament play, if a player acts out of turn, it's not binding. So okay. when the player in front of him raises, he can take the 400 back. He could back. take it back. Now, if it's a continue, you know, because obviously people make a mistake and, yeah. they, and they call. But if, uh, if, it, if it's something where they're doing it a lot, uh, to try to mess up the action, then we would give him a penalty. But in this case, yes, he could take it back. Okay, so what if there was like a raise in front of him and he said raise, but he didn't know that uh, it's, still, it's, it's still exactly it, the same situation? Yeah, he yeah, has the option. Yeah, no, you give, him, you give him his money back and you just say, okay, now it's up to you. Now what do you want to do? And would that be the same in a cash game? Uh, cash games, uh, they, every, every house has different rules. Okay. Great. Thank you very much. The, and the, the difference between cash game and a tournament is the tournament, it affects everybody left, where a cash game, it just affects just the two people in the, in the, the game. That makes sense. So that's why the rules sometimes vary. Right. Exactly. Great. Thank you very much, Jack. You're welcome. Lizzie Harrison with Jack McClellan for Card Player TV.